back in 1905, Einstein's interpretation of a photoelectric effect has first appeared. At that time, quantum physics was on peak. People were believing that light exists in a wave form. But in the explanation, Einstein explained that light has a particle nature. Many renowned people opposed this. Robert Andrews Millikan, an American physicist, had been one of the strongest opponents of Einstein's interpretation. Even today and earlier, Einstein is very strongest personality in terms of intellect and science that no one dares to stand against him. But Robert has shown his courage to stand against him and want to prove Einstein wrong. He set out his research and started out with testing the idea in the series of superb experiments. He spent 10 years in proving Einstein's explanation wrong, that light exists in a particle nature. But in 1914, he ended up with the climax that Einstein's explanation of a photoelectric effect in terms of light quanta or photons was correct. Even his direct experimental proof supported Einstein's model of photoelectric effect. In 1921, Einstein was awarded the Nobel Prize for his discovery of the law of photoelectric effect. But what did Robert get after spending 10 years of life? The failure wrapped in success story is, in between the process of proving Einstein wrong, he derived a very accurate value of Planck's constant, that is h. Due to the experimental determination, he also measured the charge on the electron. To complete the irony, in 1923, he also received the Nobel Prize for his discoveries, his work on the elementary charge of electricity and on the photoelectric effect. Millikan is still known today best for his famous oil drop experiments. Now this is the perfect example of success from failure. If you got failed in anything, it doesn't mean you will not achieve anything. Every time you fail, you definitely gain something. Sometimes you just need the power to raise a question. You can change anything. Thank you. Thank you so much.